Hi, I'm Lauren Kazala, Investment Planning Editor at The Motley Fool. When most people think about Social Security, they focus on the money it pays to retirees and their families in their old age. But Social Security also provides other key benefits. Here to talk about those benefits is Dan Kaplinger, longtime Fool contributor and retirement expert. Hi, Dan. Hi, Lauren. So, Dan, what do people forget about with Social Security benefits? Well, most of the time, what they don't realize is the other benefits other than the old age benefits that come. They forget about things like disability, also known as SSDI. They forget about supplemental income, or SSI. They forget about survivor's benefits, not just for spouses, but for kids if something happens to, those fo to, to them before they reach retirement age. What benefits are available for those who become disabled? Well, basically what SSDI does is it provides disability benefits if something happens to you that you aren't able to work. Now, there are some requirements involved. You have to have worked for a certain period of time during your career, and you have to have a certain amount of recent work history. But if you do, you can get benefits. In addition, your spouse can get benefits, and any kids that you have are, are also potentially eligible. If your spouse is younger than age is, is older than age 62, or if your child is below the age of 16. Tell us about Social Security's SSI program. Well, SSI is actually a needs-based program. It's a supplement to Social Security, but it's something that you're eligible for either if you're disabled or if you're over age 65. So it's not for the general public, but it is something that can add on to SSDI so that people with disabilities can end up getting paid twice. And basically, it's based on income. So if you have below a certain amount of income, you may be eligible to get this extra SSI benefit. Now, the benefits differ from state to state. There's a federal minimum that's established that's $710 per person monthly or $1,066 for couples. But states can make changes to that program based on their own particular needs. They can even run the program themselves. So it differs from state to state. What survivor's benefits are families eligible for? Well, the thing that most people forget about is that if, you, if something happens to you before you reach retirement age, your spouse and any minor children that you have are still eligible for survivor's benefits as long as the spouse is taking care of a minor child or is reaches at the age of 62. In addition, if a child is, is above age 18 but was disabled, they can still retain benefits for the remainder of their adulthood. Thanks, Dan. And to learn more about Social Security and your benefits, be sure to stay tuned to more Conversations with Dan right here at The Motley Fool.